we regularly receive programs for uh, consideration for airplay, for broadcast, and this program came by way of public media service, and they send us several throughout the year. Uh, this one was just compelling enough to uh, for us to air at a special time. We air several of the public media service programs throughout the year at different times, normally on uh, Friday nights at 7. Most of them are music-related programs. And this one does have some good music to it, but it was a combination between myself and Greg Jenkins, our operations director, but usually a staff decision. Uh, we look at what is available and where we can air it, uh, put it on for broadcast and what accommodations and that we can make for the program. West of Memphis Voices for Justice is a program I encourage everyone to listen to and also to view the documentary if you get the chance. It's an extremely compelling story um, about uh, lives that are changed due to misfortunes and circumstances and also the victims in this case. Uh, there are three young boys who were murdered and people are still not brought to justice, so it's an open case. But also the three young men who were sent to prison for a crime that they didn't commit. Close to 20 years of a life sentence they spent from their adolescent uh, teenage years all the way through uh, becoming men in prison. So it's an extremely compelling story. It, it can be related to everyone who listens to uh, seeking justice every day, not to judge people based on first impressions and also to seek out all the details on, on whatever life might bring you. So I think it, everyone should tune in to listen and look at the documentary. And there's also a soundtrack that's available with extremely good music from um, Henry Rollins to uh, Marilyn Manson to Natalie Maines, uh, Dave Matthews. So the soundtrack itself is extremely compelling and I encourage everyone to, to tune in and, or view as they can.